Welcome to 25 days of Dark Fridays edition 3, day 11. Let's get started. Okay, so day 11 is customer with the highest customer lifespan. You look in the glossary, customer lifespan is the customer that has been with us the longest, which means that the first order date and the last order date is the highest number of days. Okay, so if we go to customer table and then we put customer ID and then we put the company name so we know we are going to report on company name and then we need to have their order date. Uh, it doesn't matter from where we get it, order date, lovely. And then we're going to export this to Excel. I've already done it so we can see what the game plan is going to be. So here we have the data in Excel. An easy way to actually do this calculation is to go and create a pivot table. So we put company name and then we put the order date twice. One is going to be for the mean value and we want to have it as a date. And the other one is going to be for the max value. And we want to have it also as a date. Now that we have this, we're going to copy this into a new sheet. So this is one, two, and three. And then we're going to do this minus this for all rows, four, and then I'm going to put the so, and we have here the grand totals we don't care about. So we have that richer supermarket has been with us 663 days. Lovely. You've seen how I've done it in Excel. So how do we do it with DAX? Very similar, actually. Let's go. DAX query, day 11, evaluate. Right. So we're going to summarize. And here we're going to summarize now the customer's table. And we need customer ID and customer name, company name, because that's the one that we will report on. Then we're going to have first purchase date, which is going to be the mean, exactly the same thing that we did in Excel of order date, order date. And then we're going to have a last purchase date and this is going to be the max of order date so this is basically the pivot table that we created in excel and it will give us the exact information now we need to calculate the diff date diff between them so we go to our columns and then i'm going to have diff dates which is going to be day diff. I think it's the first minus the last, if I don't remember correctly, or if I remember correctly. <laughs> and then our columns, we run, and then, yeah, there we have the date. See, we order by, we will see, but, you know, how about we do it already on the measure? We go up here, new measure, Day 11, top end, one, and here we're going to have based on diff dates, descending. And then we grab everything and we're going to concatenate on company name, company name, Ascending, lovely. And then we have it. Richard Supermarket is the one with the height that's been with us the longest, basically. So I will see you again on day 12.